today we'll try to explore one more concept so which is related to linked queries so basically i have one excel file so in this excel file i have the two different sheets in the sheet one i have some numbers i mean just assume that upon numbers and sheet two i have this some the same data but here have the some extra names are there so now what i want to know so i want to apply the vlookup so vlookup this is my lookup value and this is my lookup uh, table comma index comma zero okay, once i hit that number i mean i update this formula so i have this data some data so now the same data how we can achieve with the link queries in ui path so just simple so we need to fetch this related the data okay sheet one having uh, names column has been empty so we need to fetch this data based on this irrespective of this accounts let me go back to your path studio and here the first step is we need to read that range i mean we need to get the data from the excel file so for that i am taking read range workbook activity okay here i need to take this path this is the my path so let me copy as this path and i updated everything and i will give the sheet name as sheet one okay and i will create here data table so let me go and i will create as excel sheet one PD. okay excel sheet one data table okay similar way i need to do for the second thing so this is reading for the sheet two data and i need to go this properties and i will update the one new variable sheet two data okay. let me close this excel file and we'll run so i'm getting the data or not let me check that Okay, downside, I will give one message box is for the reference purpose to checking that data. So just I will make it as check. That's fine. So I'm running this bot. So its execution has been completed and I want to check the sheet one data. So you can see this. So in the sheet one, I have the two data, but it's having the only one. One column having the data, another column we need to fetch from the sheet two. Okay, now I will go and check. Let me update here. Excel. Okay, here you can see this. Thing. So I have the accounts name and I have this data. Okay, this is done. So we are getting the data. So now what we want to know. So we need to get that account uh, column names. For that, I am taking one activity which we call assign. Okay, in this as an I will create one more variable. So let me get it data table output. Okay, and here I will do, I mean, I'll just pass this Excel data table dot clone. Okay, it will use this me data. So now we need to change this uh, variable to, let me change and I need to change to data table. Okay, what it will do now, it will give us my headers. So let me show that headers. Let me run this part quickly and we can say this. So I will just, I will show this data table also. So we can see this, we got this headers. So if we use data table dot clone, so it will give only affects the only the columns. The next step is we need to write the link query. So for that, I am taking the assign activity. So I'm drag and dropping the assign activity and I'm creating the one variable which I call output. And here I will pass this query. So this is a query which I uh, have built here. So just I will copy and I will paste here. Later I will explain these things. Okay, here we need to go and check this uh, type of this variable. So if you see this variable, so this is the collection I and mean, system dot collection dot generic list and we have this list which will come in that list we need to take this data row so uh, whatever the data is coming it's entirely converting into the rows now let me go to this here okay so when you see here we have see the couple of lines are there so the first step uh, from row in excel sheet one data table as numerable so whatever the data i read in this particular uh, read range workbook now so the data enter i convert as numerable and similar way downside is also the same thing but here i just add the group join so whatever the data is says now just uh, as an joining that both of these two take i mean two data tables so later 
in the third line on convert dot to ring so what i am doing now so it will just checking uh, in the sheet one account and sheet two account both are matching same numbers or not so it will fetch fetching that both the things and from temp in group so i'm going to declare the one temp variable and group dot default empties so just assigning the data and finally select uh, data table rows add of row field one dot if this is not nothing then i don't want to tell if it is having something value then i'm assigning everything into the particular list so this is a query which uh, we can uh, update the these things okay now i will just click on this okay and i'm running this bot so already i put the breakpoint here no need to do worry so let me run this so i will show you all the things first one is uh, excel data table so let me show you so we have this data and similar way we have excel let me update excel data table 2 okay this is the data i have so now i will show you this data table clone so in this data sorry data table okay holiday is done now so that's why we are not getting data so let me the final okay, what i declared here okay i just not converted the everything so if you see observe here data table output so in this output i have this i got this requirement data so now i'm opening this excel file okay now if you see observe so let me go to the sheet 2 first of all so whatever the data is available so it's done so when i come to sheet 1 so these three things so if you see 45 uh, 27 and double 75 so it got fetched from this data and we can see this irrespective of data linux so linux is 45 and we have this tick sack 775 and 27 del so this is the way how we can use this link query to extract the data with i mean it's kind of similar we look up we called so this is a link query so how we, we can fetch this let me show you here so this is the thing so just whatever the data is there now so you can just follow this and uh, you will try to uh, update the same thing and you will get the lookup data similar kind of that okay i hope uh, this uh, link query which is not clear to that so if you have any doubts uh, please post me in the comment section i will try to explain and don't forget to subscribe